Before we start this video, if you found this video helpful in any way, be sure to leave a like and subscribe. If you play Blade Ball on Roblox, leave a like and subscribe. What's up everyone, welcome back to another Roblox Blade Ball video. In this video, I will be showing you all my auto clicker settings for whenever I decide to actually use an auto clicker. So, the auto clicker that I use is called OP Auto Clicker right here, and there are some things that you have to change from the default settings. So, on the default settings, this will say 100 milliseconds. Change this to zero so that it clicks as often as possible. The mouse button you can customize to whatever you want it to be. The click type, I prefer double because that's double the clicking, faster the clicking. And for the repeat, make sure you put repeat until stopped. If you only repeat it once, there's no point in using an auto clicker. For a cursor position, make sure you click current location. And for your hotkey, it is basically up to you. Me personally, I chose F6 on my keyboard, but whatever you want, make it your hotkey. So we are going to go to the training area and then we're going to play a game and I'm going to show just how good this auto clicker is. So I'm just going to manually start it up right now with this right here and we are going to play with the auto clicker really fast. Okay, so I'm going to manually turn the auto clicker on and it is going to make Blade Ball 10 times easier. As you see right here. Oh, that was a bad example. Okay, well that clearly did not work out in training, but we are going to try it in an actual game. And let's see just how good using an auto clicker is in Blade Ball. Okay, so the game has started and I'm probably not going to start the auto clicker until it comes down to the very end when I might have to clash with someone. But I don't know. I don't know. But right now, we're just going to hang out and I'm not going to use it just yet. Oh my goodness. Okay, so ball is coming for me. Boom, I'm gonna hit it. Oh, hit it back. Hit it back. Oh, okay, cool. I'm, I thought I was gonna have to use the auto clicker right there. I guess not. I guess not. All right, ball is coming for me again. Boom, there we go. All right. Oh my goodness, this thing is going really fast. All right, never mind. Spoke too soon. Oh. Oh, okay, boom. I used my ability right there, but I didn't even need to use it. Oh, oh my goodness, I got another person. Okay, so I guess my ability actually worked out in my favor. Okay, cool. I might not even have to use the auto clicker here. I don't know. Oh my gosh, standoff time. All right, I don't even know if I'm just gonna go clash or I don't even know. I don't even know. Okay. Oh my goodness, no! Okay, I didn't even use the auto clicker right there. Oh my goodness. All right, we're gonna try one more game and we are actually going to properly use the auto clicker. And I'm gonna start it up for the entire game. Oh my goodness. All right, we're back in another game and ball is going to me first. All right, I'm gonna start up the auto clicker and we're just gonna have it run the entire game. We're gonna hope for the best. <laughs> All right, game is going, game is going. Not much to commentate on right now, but the game is in fact going. All right. Ball is to me again. I think the, wait, what? The auto clicker messed me up. This is your sign not to use an auto clicker in Blade Ball. It will mess you up. Anytime I play Blade Ball, I never actually use an auto clicker, but I know there's a whole auto clicking community. But these are the best settings for an auto clicker. I'm just not used to actually playing with one. So if you all enjoyed this Blade Ball video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Like I said, subscribe for more Blade Ball content. If you play Blade Ball, subscribe. And with that, thank you all for watching. I will see you guys next time. Stay breezy.